video of mine. Thank you for watching today's vlog. It's Thursday, April 4th, and I decided to start a little weekend vlog today because I'm actually about to run out the door and head to a workout class. I'm heading to Casa Cipriani down in the financial district, and it's with house ID, so we're going to get some gear, some workout clothes, and yeah, we're going to have a workout class with a professional trainer, I think by the name of Matt Tralley. I could be pronouncing that wrong, but I'm just really excited. I have a feeling it's going to be a hard, sweaty class. At least I hope so, but I might be waking up sore tomorrow. Anyway, I got ready, got dressed, and I'm going to head out now, arriving a little bit early because I think they're giving us our workout clothes to change into before the class. So it'll be very fun, but yeah, let's hit it. actually so much fun like I tried to take little clips during the workout and usually like the way these classes go um, everyone that's there gets invited by some form of like a PR team and sometimes it's a lot of different like PR companies and there's like magazine editors company owners media people like some influencers content creators just all different kinds of people in the business, which is just so fun because then you get to meet so many different people that maybe you wouldn't have. And the workout itself was so hard. Like, there, I'll include, if they're not too embarrassing, some clips of me like really struggling. It was definitely a good push and I needed that. And I'm very happy I went. And we got a goodie bag. I already changed out of the outfit that I wore because it was like shorts. So I couldn't walk home in that, but let's see. I'll show you guys what I got. Gatorade to replenish the electrolytes. Oh, this is my water. They gave us some Catalina Crunch. They gave us a recipe for trally, trally dough smoothie. Matt Trally was our instructor. And House ID is the brand that invited me, I guess you could say. Um, I also haven't looked through this yet, so I don't know. Through Ni Niagen? Let's see. It's like a supplement. This is interesting. I got like a shot 
of cold brew concentrate. Nothing. Cute, okay. Another house ID product. This is protein powder. New Zealand grass-fed whey. Nice. The email they sent me, so that is Matt, if anybody knows him. I didn't before today, but he's super nice. Smart sweets that are like healthy candy. And that's it. And then this blue house ID tote to add to my collection of 100 million thousand totes. Okay, now it's about 1.30. I have a call at 2.30. And I just have like a bunch of emails to answer and send out. So probably going to do that for the next couple hours. And then... Hello guys, quite some time has passed. It's like 5.45 right now. And once I got back, I did some emails like I said, had my call and showered. And after I got out of the shower, I had like a bunch of missed calls and texts from my manager saying that there was a rush casting for a voiceover. So luckily I didn't have to like do my hair or makeup or anything, but I did have to just record a bunch of stuff. Um, so I just finished that, sent it over, and now Max and I are going to eat some shakshuka as like a midday snack, pre-dinner snack. We're hungry, so... After that, I think we might meet up with some friends. It's his brother's birthday, so maybe we'll grab some drinks. But as of right now, I'm in my comfy clothes. And I'll probably watch um, And Just Like That on HBO Max until later. Oh, yes. Hello guys, what's up? Good morning. Obviously, I did not vlog anything um, after I last talked to you, but it was kind of a chill, a chill night, a chill evening. And today, I'm, I'm up and at them. It's actually sunny out in the city. It's not freezing, finally. I think this week is gonna be the start of actual spring, and I'm sure we're gonna have a few more showers because April showers bring my flowers. But it's supposed to be like in the 60s and inching towards 70s, and I'm very excited. But it's a busy day today, so I got up this morning, had some coffee, and basically immediately started getting ready because I have like a four-hour remote shoot. So this is the first time that I've done something like this where the brand like wants to be on um, like Zoom with you. So it's kind of like actively being directed. Um, and it's very interesting. So I kind of just wrapped that up and now I'm gonna upload all of the raw files so that they have them in their system and can use them for the ads. I don't think I'm gonna mention the name of the brand because I'm not sure if I'm supposed to, but it's a skincare company so you know, one of my favorite things. Who doesn't love some good skincare? So it's been a fun but busy morning. The apartment was like flipped upside down because I needed to film in a few different areas and in a few different outfits and certain products needed to be seen. Um, so it's just been kind of like crazy and my bedroom is really scary. But um, since I just finished, I'm gonna take like five minutes send this all in, regroup, and then we're gonna clean the apartment. Oh, and then I can't forget, I have to, I have to book a flight today. Ah! I don't think I've talked about it on my vlog yet, but I'm going somewhere very exciting at the end of April, so I'm gonna be booking my flights today, but I will tell you guys what that's all about later. What time did we wanna leave on Sunday? Cause I just picked a random one, I picked 1 p.m. Sunday is the 5th. Yes. Just get up, pack okay, up, and go. See. Yeah. What do you think, Max? That's jet blue. That's the cheapest one. I mean, maybe that's better, because then we have, like, the day. Oh, okay. So basically, here's the deal. I'm going with some of the cast to Los Angeles because the short film that I was in that premiered originally at the Soho Film Festival in September is now premiering at the Beverly Hills Film Festival. And we're so excited. This is like 
kind of a big deal and definitely a big opportunity for all of us. We found out that our screening is on May 1st, which is the opening day of the entire festival. And it's being hosted at the TLC Chinese Theaters on like Hollywood Boulevard. So all the things, all the things. Um, I, If you guys like watch my channel or follow me on Instagram, you may know that I do a fair amount of traveling. And I have not been to the West Coast or like anywhere over there since I was probably 12, 13, 14 years old maximum. So this is very exciting because now I'm like an adult, I'm more matured, I can do adult-like things. I'm going with some friends and Max and I'm very sad that my mom, my mom won't be able to join because I know that she would have a blast. But we're going to have a lot of fun. So right now it's pretty stressful because it's really not that far away and of course we all waited till the last minute so I have to book my flight. That was so stressful. I hate booking flights, but it's done. Thanks to Max for the help. Okay, now we have basically two weeks until that trip. No, a little more. Almost, what's today? Yeah, a little over two weeks. But it's time to start figuring out what the heck I'm gonna wear to the premiere. I don't know the vibes, but we'll figure it out. Max and I are now off. To get groceries, I have my tote bags filled with other tote bags. Always bring your reusable bags. But we are out of groceries and we have been for a few days, so it's gonna be a big haul. Okay guys, we just walked in from the grocery store. We went to two different spots. It took like, what'd you say, an hour? No. Less than that? We went, we went to two different spots. Oh, yeah, we went to two different spots. It took an hour. And we got back literally just in time as we were walking in the front door. It started raining. But we have so much food. The bags are insanely heavy. And I'm going to do a haul with you guys. Max and I, the way we like to do it is we always try and go into the grocery store with meals in mind that we want that week. So that way we can just gather the necessary ingredients and whatever else we feel along the way for like lunch or things to snack on. Just put away some broccoli and asparagus because we're gonna make broccoli and sausage pasta and asparagus risotto. I think he also put the sausage away. I'm not sure what this is. That's celery. Celery. I think we're gonna make chicken salad sandwiches. We got two things of rotisserie chicken. Four dollars. Good to chop up. Chicken. We got some Martin's butter bread. How do you put it away over there? We got goat cheese. Mmm, maybe that's a good snack for right now. Yeah. Eggplants for caponata. A mixture, a mixture of onions and some cilantro, it seems like. And two jalapeno peppers. Cherry tomatoes. Dozen of eggs, gallon of lactate. That's it? No. Oh. More bags. Ooh, the last two bags. We got this ginormous thing of ketchup because personally I love ketchup. Here's the broccoli. Ooh. We got a mango, apple, two lemons. We got QP mayo and heavy cream for cooking. Sourdough bread. Four chicken breasts, three bell peppers, so many potatoes, two cans of tomatoes, and I needed to get cereal to snack on. Cocoa Krispies were this week's choice. And last but not least, coffee. So that's the gist of what we got. What are we gonna make with that? We have asparagus risotto, chicken salad sandwiches, short ribs. No short ribs. We didn't get short ribs? Didn't get short ribs. Okay, that's why I didn't show them. Um, but we have chicken and wine. Chicken cutlets. Chicken cutlets. Pasta with broccoli and sausage. 
caponata to go with the chicken cutlets. Uh, beans and bacon and white wine. Um, Stuff to make sandwiches. We have like sourdough. Spanish omelet I want to make too. Potato and onion. Lots of good stuff. I'll keep you guys updated throughout the week of what Tacos we eat. we can make. Yeah. Bolognese we can make. The options are endless. Mmm. That chicken smells so good. We're so hungry, we are gonna make a snack and eat. We went with chicken salad sandwich as a snack. It looks so good. Good morning guys, what is up? It's another day and it's so sunny. The sun is just beaming into the apartment. Um, I woke up kind of early this morning and I've just been chilling on the couch having coffee. And then Dana texted me and was like, why don't you come over to my apartment in Brooklyn and we can like hang out, take some content. And she's dog sitting this super cute like pit bull puppy. So since it's super nice out, it's like 70 degrees and sunny, I was like, you know what? Let's do it. Let's head over there and just like get out of the house for the day. Nothing crazy. I'm actually kind of already sweating in this like long black skirt and thick sweater, but the sun is really sunning. I think if I spend time outside, I might be able to catch some color. Good thing I put my SPF on today. But I'm gonna hop out the door and take the train over to Brooklyn. <laughs> What don't you like about it? I like the brown shoes. Just hide it with the belt and the cream. Oh, I have the worst heartburn. Don't mind the pee pee pads. <laughs>